हेलो एवरीवन यू वाचिंग एजुपीडिया वर्ल्ड वीडियोस वी आर लर्निंग पावर पॉइंट एंड माय नेम इज नीरू वर्मा टॉपिक फॉर टुडे सेशन इज वर्किंग विद द बुलेट्स एंड नंबर्स एंड स्टार्टिंग विद द इंट्रोडक्शन वी विल डिस्कस दैट व्हाट इज द नीड ऑफ यूजिंग बुलेट्स एंड नंबर्स इट्स इंपॉर्टेंट टू मेक दी स्लाइड्स ईजी टू रीड फॉर द ऑडियंस सो बुलेट्स एंड नंबर्स are the best way to do it the common way of doing this is to format the text using the bullets and the numbers by default when you you will type your text in the placeholders a bullet will be placed at the beginning of each paragraph this is called the bulleted list and if you want you can modify the list by choosing different style of the bullets and by switching to a numbered list also In this session we learn how to modify the existing bullets change the bullet style switch to the number list remove how to remove the bullets and numbers and how do we select the symbols So let's proceed and discussing about the course goal the all operations we are going to perform in this session is need need of modifying the list then how to modify the bulleted list how to modify the number list change the starting numbers modifying the list appearance size and color and customizing the bullets use pictures as the bullets and use symbol as the bullets okay so first thing we'll discuss about need of modifying the list when we are working on a particular list or you can say when you are explaining your time uh, you are explaining your text then it's um, important that the content would be readable for a user so making the small notes and representing it as the bullet is the best way to make it the most representable it will become easy to understand for a user when the text is written in a proper format with the help of the bullets and with the help of the small lines or small points so this is the need of modifying a list that we want to show the text as more professional and easy to read for a user the next point is modifying the bullet style if you want to modify the bullet style on the home tab you can click on the bullets here it is click on the drop down and you will get a menu here and lot of bullet options will appear there are different styles the bullet is changed here you can use any kind of bullet you can select the entire text and now you can try to change the yeah, this is these are the ways from the list you can select any kind of bullets if you want to modify the numbered list you need to select the text first of all then once again click on the home tab and select the number option numbering click on the drop down menu and you will get different option like 1 2 3 in this way you want to show the text you can place your cursor here and you can see that on the slide the options are getting changed for example if you select this a b c you can check on the slide that all the points are represented as a b c d now these are the ways by which we can represent the numbers now we have selected all the numbers here the other option would be change the starting numbers by default when we are creating a list that would take the first element as number 1 number 2 and in this way it start but if we want that this particular content is in continuation with the previous slide or with some other presentation then we may want that the numbers would start with some other number other than 1 then how do we do it you need to click on the numbers bullet and numbers this option here bullet and numbering now under the number there is a option start at instead of 1 if you select 1 it's going to show all the numbers as 1 2 3 so you can increase the number here you can make it 7 8 9 whatever and you can click on okay 
let me select the text first then uh, bulletin numbers and start the test text with let's say number 5 click on ok now your numbers are starting with 5 6 7 8 9 and 10 in this way we are getting all the points now let's make it bulleted text again okay next we have is modifying the list appearance size and color how do we do it first of all you need to select the entire text control a is the shortcut for selecting it now click on the home tab and again on the bullets click on the drop down bullets and numbers now here is the option to change the size of the bullet and to change the color you can increase or decrease the size of the bullets and similarly you can change the color of the bullets suppose we make it green so the color of the bullets are changed and the size of the bullets are also changed we have increased the size now next we'll discuss about customizing the bullets we have two options available here you can use the pictures as the bullet and you can use the symbol as the bullet as well let's discuss about using the picture as a bullet first you need to select the text first then click on the bullet drop down under the home tab click here bullets and numbers in the dialog box you need to select the desired picture click on the picture here you will get a lot, lot of options now you can see here that the bullets are changed to that particular pictures there is one more option here that click on this bullets and numbers once you click on picture you have one import option also here you can click on this import option and you can use your own picture to show as a bullet also if you have some icon or some picture that you want to be used as the bullet So now we have changed the bullets as pictures. Now the other option we have is use the symbol as a bullet. How do we do it? Select the entire text, click on the home tab and then bullets again. Select bullet and numbering. There is one option here customize once you click here you will get a list of the symbols based on the phones you will be getting different symbols here you can select the font wingdings as per your requirement you can select any of the font however you will get a lot of option here in the wingdings the symbols actually and you can make really good choices because you have large number of symbols here that can be used as the bullets suppose if you want to use this particular symbol you can click on ok then click on ok once again now you will be getting these symbols as the bullets So this is the way by which we can modify the bullet style, we can modify the number list, we can change the starting numbers, we can modify the list appearance, the size, the color etc. We can customize the bullets also by using the pictures and by using the symbols as well. 
so in this session we have learned about high, how we can play around with the bullets the, the num how we can increase their size how we can change the colors all the properties of the bullets and numbers we have discussed so that was it for today's session thanks everyone thank you for watching azupedia world videos